हेलो नमस्ते सत श्रीकाल अदाब वेलकम टू इंडिया लार्जेस्ट क्विज ऑन स्पोर्ट्स एंड फिटनेस यू आर हेयर विद मी कमल बग्गा इन येट अनदर एक्साइटिंग एपिसोड ऑफ फिट इंडिया क्विज 2023 ब्रॉट यू बाय द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ यूथ अफेयर्स एंड स्पोर्ट्स लेट्स सी इन विच स्टेट वी आर स्टॉपिंग बाय फॉर टूडेज एपिसोड In northwestern India lies the land of five rivers Punjab flourishing with fertile plains nurtured by the Satluj, Bees, Ravi, Chenab and Jhelum rivers Known as the granary of India Punjab boasts a vast agricultural heritage and rich cultural tradition that paints a scenic picture of the state Beyond its fields Punjab tantalizes the taste buds with mouth-watering flavors. Aromatic curries, fluffy rotis and decadent desserts. The ad pulses with the energetic beats of Bhangra, a folk dance that reflects the Punjabi spirit of joy and celebration. Renowned poets and writers like Amrita Pritham, Gurdial Singh and Kushwant Singh illuminate Punjab's literary legacy their words painting vivid portraits of Punjabi life and emotions This colorful state is also a hotbed for sports enthusiasts Netaji Subhash Chandra Bose National Institute of Sports located in the Patiala city of Punjab is considered a premier sports institute in Asia Traditional sports such as kabaddi gatka kushti and kido draw thousands into the sporting fold in the state legends like balbir singh senior pardhuman singh brad and harbhajan singh have proudly represented punjab nationally and internationally and now it's time to witness the energy of punjab's young champions as they race for the finish line in this episode of fit india quiz we are in the land of warriors and saints and we'll get our two finalists from punjab in this episode and on team number 1 we have raghav arora and akhilesh singh panwar from swami sant das public school jalandhar on team number 2 we have manjot singh and mehak preet kaur from kendri vidyalaya husharpur on team number 3 we have pushkar sharma and dharmendra choudhary kendri vidyalaya amritsar kent amritsar On team number 4 we have Balwinder Singh and Jasmine Kaur KV number 2 Husainpur Amritsar Welcome to all of you teams We will have three exciting rounds of quizzing in the state semi finals of Punjab and here are the rules of first round get set go It's time for the first round of the quiz get set go In this round each team starting with team 1 will have an opportunity to select a topic of their choice remember once a team has chosen a topic it becomes unavailable to the other teams after selecting your topic a question will be displayed on the screen without any options you can answer directly and earn 20 points however if you are uncertain about the answer there is no need to worry you can opt to view the options once the options are revealed you will have three opportunities to choose the correct answer If you guess it correctly on the first try, you will score an impressive 15 points. On the second attempt, you will earn 10 points and on the final try, you will receive 5 points. You will have 25 seconds to answer a question, whether or not you choose to view the options. There are no negative marks in this round and questions will not be passed to the other teams. This gives everyone a fair chance to excel. Let's get started and all the best. In this round teams will have 6 topics to choose from and I'll start with team number 1 Swami Sandas and before that I'll explain the 6 topics surprise sports books sports history indigenous sports local and khelo india so first question to swami sandas cool what's your pick of topic yes sports team history. swami sandas sports history Okay they are going with sports history let's see the first question of this quiz appearing on screen now Duke Kono Kahana Moku an Olympic swimmer and actor from Hawaii 
is considered as the father of the modern day form of which sport? Your timer has already started. Do you want to look at the options? Uh, options. Okay, options here. Give me your first pick for plus 15. Your time is running out. 8 seconds remaining. Quick team. Uh, artistic swimming. Is incorrect. Try for plus 10. Surfing. Okay, your timer was up. You said surfing. Surfing is indeed the correct answer, but your timer was up. I cannot award you any points. So sorry, team. You have to open your account in the given period of time. I'm afraid I'll award you only zero points. So surfing is the answer I was looking for. And we quickly move to team number two, KV Gajbunga. Okay, one option is down. That is sports history. Five to go with. What's your pick? Indigenous sports. Okay, they are going for indigenous sports. Let's see if they can answer it right or not. In which form of Punjabi Kabaddi does the Raider not say the word Kordi aloud? The timer has started. Punjab style. You said Punjab style without looking at the options. It is incorrect team KV Gajbunga. I, the, it is evident from the question that it is Punjabi Kabaddi. But I wanted the particular form where they do not say the word. Okay, try for brownie points. You have the options Gemini, Sonchi, Lumbi or Gungi. Uh, Gungi. Gungi, in fact, is the correct answer. You could have asked for options, but you went too early. So, so sorry, you will not get any points. Gungi was the answer for this question. No points to any team so far. Let's see if KV Amritsar can open the account for this quiz. And three options are down and three to go. What's your pick, KV Amritsar? Surprise. Okay, they are going for a surprise. Let's see the question in surprise. Which discipline focuses on exploring the science of human movement? You have to give me the science of human movement. Which discipline focuses on it? Your timer has already started. Do you want to look at the options? Do you want to look at the options? Okay, here are your options. Give me your first try for plus 15. Kinesiology. You say kinesiology and you start with plus 15 in this round. Well done, KV Amrit, sir. Kinesiology, the answer I was looking for. Well done. You have opened your account with plus 15 with your answer on kinesiology. Good going. And the last question of this round will go to KV Hussainpur. You are left with three options to choose from. What's your pick? Sports or books. They are going for sports books. Let's have the question on screen. Six machine. I do not like cricket. I love it. Is the autobiography of which flamboyant cricketer from the West Indies? And your timer has started. Option. Okay, options. Here are your options. Legends from West Indies. Bravo. Appearing in Brain Bravo. Bravo is not correct. Try for plus 10. Chris Gale, Chris Gale. You are going for Chris Gale and you hit a 6 with this plus 10 to you, KV Hussain Paul. Chris Gale is in fact the correct answer and you must be fan of Chris Gale, huh? Yeah, okay. yeah. 333. So you must... Okay, 333. They know the jersey number. 333 is the highest score by Chris Gale in test. Well done, KV Hussain Paul. You open your account with 10 points. So first round is done. Let's have a look at the scores. Two teams are yet to open their account. Swami Sandas and KV Gajbunga. And KV Amritsar is on 15 points and KV Hussainpur is on 10 points. But not to worry, Swami Sandas and KV Gajbunga, there are two more rounds to go. You can up the ante and score there. And before we move to our second round, that is the second lap. First, have a look at the rules. Welcome to the second lap. In this round, teams will pick their topics in reverse order, starting with the last team. Each question in this round will feature six images, out of which only four are correct. 
For every correct selection, your team will earn 5 points. However, be cautious. If you choose an incorrect option, your score for that question will reset to zero and your turn will end there. If a team manages to select all four correct images, they will receive a bonus of 5 points. So when in doubt, it might be wiser to stop and secure the points you have. There is no passing of questions in this round. Each question comes with a maximum time limit of 45 seconds, so you'll need to be both quick and accurate. Good luck! Teams, this round is a little tricky one because 25 points are up for grabs but you have to strategize and see which options are correct, 4 are correct and 2 are incorrect. You have to apply your mind and think out of the box to answer these questions. So here is the list of topics on the picture board, Olympics, Asian Games, Cricket, Sporting Terms, Combat Sports and Surprise. Okay, we will go with KV Hussainpur first. What's your pick for Sir, this round? Cricket. Okay, cricket seems to be their favorite sport. Let's see if they can answer it. List the ODI World Cup winning captains. I'm looking for ODI World Cup winning captain. Your timer has started. Give me your first pick for plus five. Uh, sir, I can speak. Yes, yes, you can. Yes. Sir, Kapil Dev. Kapil Dev will fetch you plus five. Uh, Arjuna Rata, uh, Arjuna Rana Tunga. Arjuna Rana Tunga will give you another plus five. Good going team. You have ten points. Do you want to continue? Uh, sir, Gilchrist. You say Adam Gilchrist. Adam Gilchrist was a great wicketkeeper batsman. He captained for Australia in matches but he was not the ODI World Cup winner captain I'm afraid it is not the correct answer oh team you missed out on your 10 points you earned hardly okay now just for brownie points what's your what will be your guesses if you have not had answered Adam Gilchrist we have some Australian legends there sir Mark yes. Vogue is not a captain sir Clive Lloyd. Oh, Clive so Lloyd. Mark Wog and Adam Gilchrist were the incorrect answers. Clive Lloyd, Arjuna Rana Tunga, Kapil Dev and Alan Border. Arjuna Rana Tunga from Sri Lanka. He won the World Cup for Sri Lanka. And Kapil Dev, of course, the 1983, 83. a historic moment in yes. Indian cricket. Alan Border from Australia and Clive Lloyd from West Indies. So no points to you. So the two question of this round goes to KV Amrit sir two options down you are left with four to choose from what's your pick of topic sir sporting terms okay KV Amrit sir is going for sporting terms let's have the question on screen list the terms used in the winter sport of curling your timer has started I want the terms used in curling Give me your first pick for plus five. Yes. Brooms. Brooms will give you plus five, correct? Sir, quit. Okay, they are settling for five and they say quit. Brooms, they say, and they get their plus five. They were not sure about other options. When in doubt, it's better to leave and quit. Well done, KV Amritsar. You get your plus five. But if you would not have stopped, what would have been your guesses? Brooms is the correct answer. Give me just for brownie points. Sir, stone. Stone would have fetched you plus five. Other two guesses? Sir, sheet. Sheet would have also fetched you plus five. Your guesses are good. The answers I was looking for were house, sheet, stone and brooms. Hey there, are you guessing the answers correctly but missing out on the rewards? Here is your 12th man chance. All you need to do is open the Fit India official Instagram page and check for the first clue in the stories. Then wait for the second clue which will be shown on your screen in the next few seconds along with a question. Your job is to call on this number and give the answer within 5 minutes and stand a chance to win exciting prizes. Here is your second clue.
and we move to KV Gajbunga for third question of this round. Two topics down. What's your pick, KV Gajbunga? The surprise. Okay, they are going for surprise. Let's see the question. List the types of yoga that are known for their meditative and relaxing techniques. Your timer has started. Types of yoga non known for meditative and relaxing techniques. Yes. Give me your first pick. 30 seconds remaining on the clock. Yes. Any answers from your side? Restorative yoga. We'll give you plus five. Restorative yoga. Your second pick for plus five again. Or do you want to stop? Sivananda yoga. We'll give you plus five. We'll give you plus five. Do you want to try your third pick or do you want to stop? Okay, your timer has ended. You answered to correct with Sivananda yoga and restorative yoga. So you get your 10 points. Well done, Team KV Gajbunga. And just for brownie points, what are your guesses? The rest of the two yogas that help in their meditative and relaxing techniques. You said Sivananda yoga and restorative yoga. Yes? Hot yoga. Hot yoga was the incorrect answer. Your points would have been set to zero. So that's good that you did not go for that answer. So power yoga and hot yoga were the incorrect answers. And the right answers I was looking for were yin yoga, kundalini yoga, sivananda yoga and restorative yoga. But KV Gajpunga has opened its account with a plus 10 in this round. And we are down with our last question and it will go to Swami Sanda School. Three topics down, three to choose from. What's your pick, Swami Sanda School? Olympics. Olympics, they are going for Olympics. Let's have the question on screen. List the Olympic events in which India has won multiple medals. Uh, hockey. I want the Olympic events. Hockey will give you plus five. Badminton. Good start. Badminton will give you another plus five. Freestyle wrestling. Freestyle wrestling will fetch you another plus five. Okay, do you want to stop or continue? Weightlifting. Weightlifting, they say, and they get the full house of 25 points. All their guesses were right. The answers were freestyle wrestling, badminton, weightlifting, hockey. They end the round with a banger. Double trap shooting and javelin throw were the incorrect answers. Well done, Swami Sandas. And we are over with our round number two. That was the second lap. And here is the score tally. Swami Sanda School leading the quiz with 25 points. And behind them, KV Amritsar on 20 points. KV Gajpunga on 10 points. And KV Husainpur matching them with 10 points. We are down to the last round in Punjab semi-final and we cannot assure which of these two teams will go to the Punjab finals. And here we go into the do or die round where anything can happen, 100 point up for grabs. Before that, here are the rules. In do or die, we introduce puzzle questions. When you buzz in, you have two choices. Play it safe to earn 10 points or risk losing 10 points or take a risk to double the points, potentially earning 20 points or risking a loss of 20 points. If the first team to buzz in answers incorrectly, the question will be passed on to the next team on the buzzer. Before providing your answer, ensure you declare whether you are playing for the default points or opting for double points. This round can significantly impact your score, so be quick, smart and confident. It will be a fast-paced round. Five questions on buzzer. First question coming up on your screen now. Teams, hands on buzzer. This is the logo of which upcoming event? Okay, Sun Swami Sant Das Public School has gone for it. Okay, what's your answer? Uh, Paris Olympics. 
you did not go for double but it is indeed paris 2024 olympics your current affairs are good and let's move to question number two of this round here we go which sports festival popularly known as the rural olympics is held annually in punjab and competitions are held for major punjabi rural sports including car race athletic events and rope building i can see no teams buzzing on this one it is an easy chance for them to up the ante and get some points if you can look at the visual okay kv ganj bunga has gone for it double or rai pur olympics come again rai pur kv ganj bunga getting the correct answer kila rai pur sports festival but they did not go for double three questions remaining in this round here comes question number 3 on your screen now which indian athlete who secured the fourth position in the 1960 rome olympics passed away due to covid 19 in 2021 it seems to be an easy question and swami sanda school has again gone for it double or default first so double you are going for double you seem to be pretty sure what's your answer milka uh, sir sardar milka singh sardar milka singh they say and it is indeed the correct answer they get plus 20 and move on to 55 points it is indeed the legendary sprinter from india sardar milka singh oh what a superb answer swami sanda school you extend your lead and you are on 55 points with this answer swami sanda is leading the quiz and i don't think any team can catch them now so teams last two question of this round penultimate question coming up on your screen now in 2000 which renowned player famously signed his contract with barcelona on a paper napkin okay kv gachpunga has gone for it 20 or minus 20 plus 10 or minus 10 what's your pick double or default double you are going for double what's your answer lionel messi they say lionel messi how did you get that answer lionel messi or did you just guess it yes team you saw barcelona and you went with their famous player lionel messi and it will fetch you plus 20 well done kv gachbunga you have extended your points to 40 kv amritsar is on 20 and kv husainpur is on 10 kv amritsar can still catch you and tie up and will have a tie breaker if they answer a plus 20 i am clearing the buzzers last question coming up on your screen now which badminton player did ishan nakvi portray in the movie saina okay kv number 2 has gone for it rcf double double or default double okay you are going for double okay what's your answer sania mirza sania mirza it's a male athlete ishan nakwe it's not the correct answer minus 22 to you team and i can see kv amritsar on the buzzer double or default first If you answer it correctly, you'll make it interesting. Double or default, KV Amrit sir. Double. You are going for double. Let's see what's your answer. Bahubali Kashyap. Bahubali Kashyap. They say, and they make our job difficult. They are tying with KV Gajbunga with an excellent answer. Bahubali Kashyap is indeed the correct answer. Oh boy, what a comeback! KV Amrit sir is on forty. and kv gajbunga is on 40 swami sandas is happy with 55 they are moving to the punjab finals and we have a tie between two teams oh what a game audience we are having a tough semi final here with two teams tying on 
For the tiebreaker, a question will appear on their screen. They have to buzz in and get their correct answer. The question of tiebreaker appearing on your screen now. Which team sport was depicted by this pictogram for the Kelo India Youth Games hosted by Haryana in 2021? You can look at the visual. There are ample hints in the visual. You can guess it. It's very obvious from the visual. It is a ball sport, if you can guess it. I see no teams on the buzzers. They are a bit tense. They do not want to take the chances. Okay, now the options will appear when I say options and you can guess it from there. Options on your screen for this question. Which team sport was depicted by this pictogram? You have your options, basketball, volleyball, football and handball. I see neither KV Gachpunga and KV Amritsar going for it. Nobody wants to lose the points and get eliminated. I think I have to close this question if neither of these teams press the buzzer. I'll close the question in 3, 2, 1 and the tie continues. Oh my God, what a semi-final in Punjab. One thing that the quiz masters hate is tie and we are in question number two of this tie breaker. No teams are budging, but something has to give in the Punjab semi-final. So let's see which team will advance. Either KV Kachbunga or KV Amritsar will make it to the final. Second question of the tie breaker appearing on your screen now. In 2022, Apollon Ladies FC player Manisha Kalyan became the first Indian to play in which prestigious league? I want the name of the league. I, don't th I do not think that any team will buzz for it. I'll have to go to the options and here are the options. Okay, Women's Super League, Division 1 Feminine, UEFA Women's Champions League and Fron Bundesliga. Okay, KV Gachpunga has finally gone for it and we will break the tie here. Yes, what's your answer, KV Gachpunga? It's time to make history. Yes. Women's Super League. They gave the answer Women's Super League and unfortunately, KV Gajpunga, it is the wrong answer. And with this, KV Amritsar goes to the Punjab finals. They did nothing, they held their nerves and they did not press the buzzer. Team KV Gajpunga got little excited and in this moment of excitement, they pressed the buzzer and they answered it wrong. Oh oh, KV Gajpunga, unfortunately, I feel sorry for you. Hard luck for you in this quiz. You came a long way, but you did not finish the line. Many congratulations to KV Amrit, sir. You are our second finalist for the Punjab finals. And let's have a look at the final standings in this stupendous Punjab semi-finals. Swami Sandas with 55 points and joining them in the Punjab finals, KV Amrit, sir, with 40 points. KV Kachpunga played bravely but they end on 30 with the negative in the tiebreaker and KV Hasenpur they were also brave but they end up on minus 10. Oh what a semi-final we had. As the race to the finals of states are coming closer we are having a banger of semi-finals but until next time I'm your host Kamal Bagga meet you in yet another exciting episode of Fit India Quiz. Stay healthy, stay curious, Jai Hind.